My name is Irene Seiletman. What I do is Navajo language teaching. And um, this is where it's at in order to, uh, you know, when you want to study Navajo language, Navajo culture, uh, because there are a lot of people who are very knowledgeable about their language and culture here. Each year since 1997, educators, scholars, and linguists have come together to study Navajo at the summer workshops of the Navajo Language Academy. Most workshop participants are members of the Navajo Nation and native speakers. Many, like Irene Silentman, are teachers. Others are graduate students. Still others, like Professor Ted Fernald of Swarthmore College, are non-native linguists with a focus on indigenous languages and cultures. When you look to see whether a language is, is uh, stable or not, uh, you have to see whether the youngest people in the community are speaking the language. There are some children who speak the Navajo language, and that's an encouraging sign. But the vast majority of children in the Navajo Nation don't speak Navajo very well, if at all. If we don't do work to reverse that trend, we will lose the language. Linguistics professor Paul Platero is a founding member of the Navajo Language Academy. Dr. Platero has documented the decline of his native language since the early 1970s. It's a paramount duty of everyone who speaks Navajo to perpetuate it. And it is, this is even more important for people who study the language. The main goal is to um, work with Navajo language teachers across the reservation, those who are teaching in the elementary or mid school or high school and also college um, teachers too. And then um, college students come. Loreen Lagai serves on the Navajo Language Academy Governing Board. An instructor of Navajo language and culture at Diné College, she teaches Navajo verb structure during the summer workshops. Why is it important to keep the Navajo language alive? Because that carries culture. You can't separate the language and, and, and um, because language is culture. You know, culture may be just a really simple word, but it means everything about who we are and where we come from and where we're going. I think that's what it represents. Ferlin Clark is president of Diné College, the site of this year's Navajo Language Academy. I think there's a real urgency for our Navajo professionals or those that are in the culture language fields to do everything we can and even in our education program here to, to prepare teachers to teach in Navajo. Members of the Navajo Language Academy have been engaged in the documentation and scientific study of the Navajo language since 1970. Their research helps preserve and promote Navajo by providing the pedagogical tools necessary to teach it comprehensively. For example, linguistic scholars Ted Fernald and Navajo Language Academy Board Chair Elevina Perkins are at work on a Navajo reference grammar, which will be used by language teachers, curriculum planners, and linguists alike. 
都脱送，你都嗯，好，这个。The Academy's all-volunteer faculty intensively trains several dozen teachers in the complex structure of Navajo for three weeks at a different place on or near the reservation each summer. Many more would like to participate but cannot attend during the summer, and there is increasing demand that the Academy provide language instruction and ready access to research materials and linguistic expertise on a year-round basis. We have a great opportunity to build on the momentum that we've, that we've developed to put into place a number of projects during the academic year to provide support for language teachers across the Navajo community, to develop uh, additional pedagogical materials, to develop additional reference materials uh, for people who are, who are working on, uh, on developing language courses. We also want to launch a media campaign that will raise awareness about the situation of the Navajo language to let people know that the language has not been, in general, passed on to the youngest generation of Navajo children. I feel very strongly about uh, my language. I have an emotional attachment to my language and I hate to see it go. Kodorajondo <laughs> Shiagi <laughs> <laughs>